What's up you guys? Zeddy at Fliptronics. We're going to be checking out the iPhone XS Max versus the XR versus the Nokia 7.1. Alright, so each one of these phones is fairly new, so I thought it'd be cool to do a comparison video on them. We're going to be doing a gaming and sound test. I do want to cover the specs real quick, and I'll have links in the description for live price updates if you want to grab any of these phones. Alright, so the XR has got a 6.1 inch display. It's an LCD. It's got an Apple A12 processor in it, and this phone sells for around 700 currently. The XS Max is the B of the three. It's got a 6.5 inch screen. It's got an OLED display, Apple A12 processor, and it sells for over a thousand. Now this Nokia 7.1 is a very impressive little phone. Um, it's got a Snapdragon 636 processor, LCD display, and it's 5.8 inch, 5 inches. Now the thing about this phone is that it's very affordable. It's only 350 bucks, comes unlocked, and I think Nokia is definitely going to be making a big comeback, you know, going into this next year. So I'm excited to see what other phones they release. All right, so the game of choice that I'm going to be doing is going to be Left to Survive. You know, it's my favorite, you know, zombie shooter to really come out all year. And I think it showcases, you know, what these phones can do as far as like just the loudness. And uh, it's a pretty high graphic game too. So I'm going to load it up on all three phones. So we can get this going, and I'm going to kick things off with the Nokia 7.1 first, and then we'll make our way to the 10R and 10S Max. Uh, message me in the comments. Uh, just let me know your thoughts on all three phones, what you guys think. And I really hope you guys enjoy some of the gameplay you know, we're about to do on them. So I've got the uh, Nokia 7.1 blasted. I'm going to blast the volume on all three phones so you can like really hear you know, the sound quality. But we, we are on max capacity down here on this Nokia. Cool. So I'm going to hop on to the 10R. I'm going to make sure it's blasted too so we can really hear the uh, sound quality on it. So let me uh, get this phone out of here and let's grab these two. Zombies everywhere. Alright, so I gotta say, you could clearly hear that the 10R is a much louder phone than that Nokia 7.1. Um, let's see how it's going to stack up right now against the 10s Max. So let's get into this. All right, so this is the beast of the uh, the three, right? So I got the volume turned all the way up. Check out that campaign, sir, where I'm at real quick. And uh, let's come do for an upgrade here.
<laughs> that was awesome right there. All right, so I do gotta say that, you know, out of all three of these phones that we just checked out, the uh, 10s Max was definitely my favorite of the three, but you know, you guys can let me know what you think in the comments about each one of them. Just wanna pull up all three phones one more time. So of course, the 10s Max here is gonna be the beast of the three, the most expensive at over a thousand. You know, if you got this Nokia 7.1, which is gonna be a lot cheaper, and it's still a very impressive phone. I mean, it's only 350 bucks. Um, the loudness of it was not nearly as loud as the 10s Max and 10R. And then, of course, we've got the 10R, which is gonna be, you know, like the new budget-friendly iPhone um, that they released that you don't have to spend $1,000 on. So, you know, like I said, um, I'm loving all three phones. They're all fairly new. Um, I'll throw some links in the description if anybody out there wants to upgrade. Maybe check one of them out on Amazon. You know, and let me know your thoughts. Uh, comment below which phone you, you guys prefer out of the three. Hit that like and share. Thanks for watching this, guys, and we will see you all later.